everyone and welcome back to my channel this is Anneli and today we are going to customize the C flip 5 really with an amazing sailor moon theme so let's do it together and this is the current flag screen that I'm using this theme that I'm using right now is actually a paid theme but I do not recommend to people who don't really want to spend much on the themes so today we are going to customize my phone with the sailor moon theme which i am going to upload the wallpapers on my pinterest account and i'm going to leave the link and all the details in my description below so please do not forget to check the description and without much time let's get started so firstly what we are going to do is we are going to change to whatever theme we want now when i say that it actually means how you want the appearance of your icons to be and also the appearance of your font and this background that you can see over here i have it in pink so we are going to change it accordingly how we want so to do that firstly i'm going to go to settings and i'm going to go to themes and once I go to themes, I'm going to click on the menu and I will click on my stuff. So this basically is going to show me all the themes that I have previously downloaded and stored in my gallery, in my theme gallery. So into this today, the theme that I am going to use is called the cute cup. So I am going to use so I am going to use this theme as my background theme. So it is going to look like this. But yes, of course, this is entirely depends on your choice. That is like what kind of theme you want as your background that you are going to choose. The theme is already applied. It looks something like this. But yes, as I told you all, we are going to change the wallpaper, the icons and whatever possible we can. So firstly, we are going to change the icons and to do so, we are going to go to the Good Locks app. Now, I already have the Good Locks app installed. So we are going to directly open it. You will go to the makeup section and then click on the theme bar. Now if you have not yet downloaded then it's going to be somewhere down. So you need to find where it is and click on it and install it. So once you install it, it is going to directly open like this. Now from here what we are going to do is we need to change the icon. So we are going to select the icon section here below. And here you are going to click on create new so once we come in here we are going to click on these dots here above and we will click on change icons so once this appears now we have to change the icon for each apps individually for whichever you want so okay friends i'm really sorry for the background sound that you all can listen that is just the neighborhood kids playing it's summertime here in the uk so all kids are out playing so i cannot avoid that so all right moving on to next so i am going to change the icons for only those which i need and only the ones that i use basically on my home page i am not going to change for the ones that i have inside my menu so firstly say i want to change for the instagram app so i click on the instagram app and now from here i need to select which one i want from here so I have firstly downloaded and saved some in my gallery which I want. So I am going to click on gallery and now from gallery I am going to choose which picture I want for that particular app of mine. So once I select that you can see it is automatically changed here. But if you want to do any changes to that particular icon you can go on edit icon and you can change it accordingly to what style you want what shape you want and whatever tray color you want but i am not going to do that because i am using the images without any background so i will just leave it blank the way it is so moving on to next this way i am going to change the icons for all and then i will get back to you all So once I'm done changing everything, I'm going to click on back and you can see how they are going to look and then we need to click on this arrow and we need to name it. So I have done the Sailor Moon theme. So I am going to say Sailor Moon and then I will click on OK. 
So now you can see it is saved over here as Sailor Moon. So I will click on it and I will click on apply. So it is going to be applied. All right, everyone. So you can see that once you click here, the all the icons have changed, and you can see this is how the inside looks like. If this thing is really affecting, then yes, of course you can change for that as well. And I think I am going to change all of those. So to do that, again you need to go to themes. You need to go to the theme park, and you need to click on the same theme, and you click on edit. So once you click on add it, you again back again click on the two dots, click on change icons and then accordingly the same way you need to go on changing. Okay everyone so this is how it looks now as I have changed all of the icons. From here I'll have to change the wallpaper as well. So what for that I have done two wallpapers of my own. Now the first one is this one which says don't touch my phone. So to apply this as your lock screen we are quickly going to click on the dots in the corner here and click on set as wallpaper and then we are going to say lock screen so it is going to apply for the lock screen now from here you can click on the date and you can adjust uh, how much you want or where exactly you want it to be or you can change the style of it and then you can change its placement and then click on done so once this is done the next one is going to be for the home page that is i have created this one and these you can download for free from my pinterest account the link to which i am going to leave in the description below so to apply this is the home screen we are going to follow the same procedure and then click on home screen so you can see it is applied on the home screen now you can see you can adjust it but i would recommend to just drag it out to its actual size because i have given it the actual size of the z flip wallpaper so you just need to pinch it in so it is it comes in its actual size and then you click on done so it is going to be applied as your home screen and this is how it looks now if you want to fill in this gaps over here then yes of course we can add some extras over there or we can just pull on the date and we can just adjust the date like this and this is how our full entire wallpaper and the phone is going to look moving on to the next one you can see over here we'll have to change the flag screen as well now you can see it has changed here as well this is the camera app over here and the cute little sailor moon icon that i have applied for it and of course we are going to change the flags window to in the sailor moon theme now i have this one and i have given the and i have shown you how to get this this you just have to download some gif images and then you need to apply them i even have more but i think the one that i have shown you previously is going to suit the most for this one what do you guys think did i do a bad choice in the flex window or is it suitable and looking good please kindly let me know i even have the sinna flex theme like this but right now based on my theme i am going to take the sailor moon theme that is this and yes of course one more thing that we have forgotten to do is to change the font of my phone and we are going to do that so i go to settings and once i go to settings from the theme section over here i am going to go to display once i go to display i go to font size and style and the font style and i will choose whichever font i want now this is the pink one and yet i have another one this one so i just can go to my main page and i can see which one i would prefer to use so you can see and now yes once this is done i'm good to go for the last part of course friends we are going to change the cover so right now that i'm using is this one and i have an other one which is going to suit my theme very well and that one is the sailor moon theme cover as well 
can see how cute it looks and this is the top of it so let's change it see we are done and this is how my father looks like alright and now let me just close it before that let me just show you a quick glance of how the final look looks like So you can see friends now this is my final phone and it really looks cute because you can hold it this way and it you don't have to worry about it falling off because nothing is gonna happen actually so this is my phone and let me quickly show you once again so this is how your flex window is going to look once everything is done and then once we open it this is how your wallpaper is going to look like and then this is going to be your main screen so i really hope you all enjoyed watching this besides this i also have an other cover and that is this one and this one is based on the cinema roll over here so next time when we come in my next video is going to be customizing our z flip 5 with a really cute cinema theme so please please if you're new then please do subscribe so you do not miss out anything and until then i hope you all enjoyed watching today's video and if you did please please do leave a thumbs up and comment below and let me know all your views and if you are using the same one then please please do comment and let me know until then i'm going to meet you very very soon with our new cena theme until then see you take care bye